the Asuka period. It took place from 538 to 710 AD, named for the capital of Japan being a city called Asuka. Here's a map of what Japan was like during this period. In this time, Japan had a few important leaders you should know about. Empress Suiko, she was the first female to rule over Japan. Under her worked Prince Shotoku, who helped implement Buddhism in Japan. Prince Naka, or Emperor Tenji, was also among these important rulers. He helped take down the Soga clan, a family in Japan that had a great amount of power during this time. Another was Emperor Saime, who helped establish the Taika reform, which was based on Confucian ideas and philosophies from China. There were also a few battles, including the Ishii incident, in which Soga no Iruka, a main leader in the Soga clan, was assassinated. There was also the Jinshin War, which broke out due to a dispute over who would be the successor of Emperor Tenji. This is a timeline outlining the f important events during the period, including the encouragement of Buddhism and the first coin being minted. In ancient Japan, they mainly spoke traditional Chinese. As for culture, they mostly ate rice, fish, and tofu. Men and women wore clothes influenced by the Chinese. They were mostly Buddhist and used the Wadokai Chin coin. When it came to education, mostly only aristocrats were educated on Buddhist and Confucian philosophies. Women in ancient Japan, as well as the feminine presence, were worshipped. However, most weren't very educated. Thank you for watching this, and I hope you found this video helpful.